came across you at yours on Instagram and decided to take the leap. I had to do it. I have actually got um, a bit of a to-do list, task list for the next year. I've recently turned 30 and to do a boudoir slash nude shoot was one of the things on my list. So that's another reason why I thought it's now's the time. Yeah, I was pretty nervous leading up to it. <laughs> pretty nervous leading up to it. But at the same time, um, I met with you, speak over the phone beforehand, have lots to look at on your website and all the rest of it to get prepared. I've never felt more prepared for a shoot. And the comfort level just gets you, if that makes sense. You, you feel like you're in safe hands. So as nervous as it is leading up to it, once you're there, it's amazing how quickly those nerves go. And you do feel ready for it. You feel you've got that connection in a way, that camaraderie, if that's the word, if I've said that right, leading up to it where you're going in, not feeling like you don't know the photographer, you're ill-prepared, you completely feel prepared, or I did anyway. Relaxed, amazingly enough. Oh no, don't, well, don't get me wrong, you have your moments, so you, you know, your clammy hand moments, but at the same time, where, um, there's a questionnaire to fill out beforehand where ask all sorts about music that you might want to listen to on the shoot and things like that. And you had all that here. So even while I'm getting my makeup done, which is lovely, that automatically relaxes you and gets you in the mood, makes you feel good. You've got your kind of music that you like in the background and it, it just makes it feel like you're, it doesn't feel, What's the word I'm looking for? You just, it makes you feel more relaxed, but like you're having fun. Not just relaxed like, ah, oh, but actually like you're really enjoying it at the same time. Oh, I just couldn't wait to see my photos afterwards. I just couldn't wait. And luckily I didn't have to wait long. And going through them was an experience. I warned you that I would cry and I did. <laughs> <laughs> even really up now thinking about it, sitting there thinking that you know there's always going to be a few shots that you don't necessarily like that much of yourself or you might think a bit like oh I'm not sure maybe but there were so many that I loved that it was difficult to then narrow it down to try and pick your favourites out of it. I that was the hardest part, <laughs> not the shoot itself, narrowing down my favourite shots it was harder. Do it. I would, ask, I would ask why they want to do it, how long they've been thinking about it, and if, they, if it's something that they're really wanting to do for themselves, I would say 100%. 100% go for it. I feel like my confidence has soared since having the shoot and I would love for anyone else to feel that way. I mean I've already had a couple of friends mention it to me when they've seen my shots and they've and they've seen how great they are and they're like oh you were so brave and I'm like no no like and they go oh I would love to do something like that. It's like okay like you know where to go then <laughs> go and do it if you want to do it for yourself then go and do it 100% I'd recommend it. What's that? What's that? Is that mine? Is that mine? Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. Fancy. Oh my god, I can't get out.